In this video, I will take you through a step-by-step -step process of how to resolve the problem of we reject your ad. And that is if your advert is rejected by Facebook. As you can see here, it says it looks like your ad contains deceptive or misleading business practices. This goes against our advertising standards on unacceptable business practices. And they've given examples. Now, when you see something like this, um, you can come here. Sometimes they may leave a link here that you can read and understand the policy in detail. If you don't see a link, just come here, right click, and then go to search web for this one. You go and search the web for the unacceptable business practices policy where you can read the details of it. If you come here, you see unacceptable business practices, ads must not promote products or services or schemes offering unidentified deceptive or misleading practices, including those meant to scam people out of their money or personal information. If you come down, they'll give you more detailed guidelines as to what in includes uh, unacceptable business practices. So if you go through it, make sure that if you understand, you come back and make changes to your ad creative. So for example, if you come here, um, this one, um, okay. So this one, I'm going to delete the ad level and create a new ad or new ad creative. So you come here and click on delete. So delete the ad level. And then you click on the three dots again and click on create ad. Now, after you click on the create ad like that, you've created, you are going to create a new ad creative. So when you check here, we have option to either create it uh, completely new from here or to use an existing post. For me, I am using an existing post. Now, before you use the existing post, you have to come back to the post. This is the post. Click on edit. If you go through it and know the product that is causing that problem, you can come here and click on edit. And then go through all the pictures. Make sure you know the one that is causing the problem. Because if you take time to go through them step by step, they will tell you exactly the one that is causing the problem. After that, you can just remove it click on done and then you save it for me i have already re uh, removed the one that is causing the problem so i'm not going to do it again i've already done it so you just come back and then click on select post so that is it if you are also using the ad creative format you can still if you are using create ad format you when you will still be able to upload the picture and then by uploading the pictures or the videos, make sure that you make those changes, just like what I have made here, and then click on publish. So you now wait for within, normally it takes within 30 minutes to two hours for them to approve it. So you keep checking. In some cases, it may even take up to 24 hours before they approve it. That's the maximum. But if you're lucky, within 30 minutes to one hour, they will approve it for you. Thank you for watching. Remember to subscribe to this channel, turn on the notification bell and like this video. Leave your comments in the comment section. Follow the WhatsApp or Telegram link to contact us if you need any solution or if you need any of our digital marketing or web development services. Thank you once again and see you in the next video. Bye.